This is a documentary of the Moffat Tunnel painting that I did for my son Michael. The painting started out when we visited Moffat Tunnel late September 2014. You can see the pictures we took there. And once that started, I did an acrylic version of the painting and put everything in I wanted. There's a close-up of the shack and the elk, and then the train and the tunnel itself. From there, I did uh, the first day I did about this much work on it, so I got most of the color blocked in in the background, especially uh, leaving the train in the tunnel to be done. The, the elk was painted over at that point, and you can see some of the colors there that I put in on the hillside as well as in the clouds. Then the painting progressed a lot more. I moved along, put the elk in, it's still a little blocked out there, uh, got a little more detail in. Um, to the elk after I put it in you can see it's only black here now you can see the elk is breathing and it has some shading to it and the painting is pretty much complete at this point these are just a couple of views if the, the signature isn't on the right then it's not totally completed once that signature is put in there then you know that's the final painting that I did um, now we're looking at all the pictures of the Moffat Tunnel that I used for reference there are several of them. I actually moved the tunnel over next to the bunkhouse because that's where I wanted it. Um, and I used a bunch of references to different trains coming out of tunnels before I finally settled on one, which is actually uh, this guy right here. I, or actually, this is the, the one that I settled on. And you can see that there are just various train pictures of trains emerging from tunnels. I also photographed a lot of elk down at Evergreen Lake. So uh, here's the big bull that was chasing everybody away, screaming. And then again, here's the bunkhouse. I enjoyed this painting. I made 100 copies that I'm going to sell and keep the original for my son.